So right here we have one of these Arcade Zero Delay USB board wireless Bluetooth joystick encoder PCB SWAN game stick controller PC PS3 PS4 3 in 1 controller DIY from Ying Lucky. Um, pretty generic module. There's not much info on them anywhere. Um, and what is here is sort of Chinglish. Um, but the key takeaways were lithium battery. But really, what it said is there's a white LED um, to show pairing. To set in pairing mode, you need to press home and share at the same time. Um, and works over Bluetooth. So, right now it's plugged into. Computer. It's got a lithium pack installed on there as well. It shows a green light. If you unplug that, it will show no light. In theory, there we go. Um, but that's okay. I'm assuming it charges the lithium pack, although I can't tell. But I think that's full now. Um, so if I short out two pins here, see it lights up my controller there. If I move over to some of the joystick pins here, some wonderful reflection in here. Um, we get another two lit up. So if we unplug it and want to use this in Bluetooth, um, I have, we'll go to Bluetooth settings here. Um, what you have to have is it connected over battery and the share and PS pins plugged in. So when you press both share and PS at the same time, you get a white flashing light. And over here it shows up as a DualShock 4 wireless controller. So we hit connect. And that's connected. So now, we should have the same functionality but wireless. So if we press that, A lights up, I press the joystick one, joystick lights up. It's a bit difficult with a knife. Um, but yeah, very simple module. Uh, just needs to be a bit more documentation on them. So here's it fully integrated. We've got two buttons here, A and B, as well as a joystick. That. Um, worth mentioning as well if you're using Bluetooth that once you unplug it, it turns off to turn it back on again uh, you have to press the home button which is uh, PS so if you hold down PS light comes on We head over to our devices here. Well, this controller connected. Um, so, in addition to buttons you're using for your arcade, whatever you're going to use, um, you probably need an extra two buttons to both pair or sh the share button or whatever it is, and then the power button to go for that PS, which I believe is home. 